Good afternoon, everyone. So, I have a beautiful old saw to to show and demonstrate today. This is my Homelite C51, what they used to call the convertible drive. These were made between 64 and 67, so between 52 and 55 years old. So, beautiful old vintage classic saw. Nice size engine as well, it's a 77cc. It's going up for sale on Gumtree and eBay for spares or repair. It's a, a, a lovely classic old saw. So I'm going to just go a quick walk around with the camera to show a few things that I've needed to add to the saw to make it, um, make it complete. So it needed a, a replacement silencer. There's a couple of options for them, but this was, as far as I could tell, one of the original silencers on the early model. So this one came from America, from a dealer. Uh, it's good value. It was only fourteen pounds delivered. Which I thought it was incredible, really. And on so many of these Homelite C fifty ones, if you ever see them for sale, they'll be missing this top cover on the engine, which is really important because it directs the air from the from the flywheel and puts it across the fins of the engine and keeps it cool. And walking around, so it's got the. Genuine Oregon bar. It's a nominal 20 inch bar with a solid nose tip. Chain is in fabulous condition. I'm not sure if the chain has, the rakers look untouched. I don't think the chain's ever been sharpened. Rotate it around. Here are the felling spikes. Pull start cover. No damage anywhere around the saw that I can see. It's been in my collection for a while. It has the original home light handle, and it's just one which I've I've had because I just love the old saws and it's just in my workshop really on show just as a as an engineering engineering beauty. Manual oil pump for the chain, choke, kill switch, all working. When I had the saw, it wasn't running great. It was hunting slightly. And so when I spoke to a, a dealer who no longer trades now, but he used to sell home light, he messaged and said, do you know, even when you replace the carburetor gasket kit, sometimes they need another carburetor. So I ordered a, a refurbished carburetor. A real beautiful thing that is. That's the Tillotson HL141, or a variation of it. They do several different variations. And since it's been fitted, it, it idles really, really nicely. So it's not a saw that I've, I've cut with. Um, I've run it and put it gently onto some wood just to see the um, how the engine copes with it. Um, so it's up for spares or repair. And the reason it's up for spares or repair is it's... Once you sold a few old saws, you start to realise that people in general, if you haven't been used to old, old engines, you know these they're they're ones which need a certain amount of care and finesse. You know she's going to be 60 years old soon, and so anybody interested, please bear that in mind. But you're more than welcome to come over and listen to the engine running, and it also I guess it may need when carburetors are fitted. They really do need to be set up with the with the chainsaws in the cut, and so this one's not had any running. It's just been in my in my ceiling, hanging down as part of my collection. So I'm going to quickly show it now because one dealer has said he just wants to see what it's like while it's cutting. So I'm going to do a quick cut, and hopefully it'll be suitable for one of you out there. And like I say, any questions, please just message. If anyone wants to come over and see it in person, they're beautiful old saws, then then please come over. Um, the person I bought or acquired it from, his father had had it believed from new and had it you know, over 50 years. So it's a, it's a rare opportunity to get a beautiful, genuine, complete home light C51. Okay. The only thing with these silences is they are incredibly, incredibly loud. What also was nice is by taking the silencer off, it let me have a chance to look at the piston, which is completely unscored.
turn it, make sure you can see it cutting wood. Of some description. Kill switch. Okay, so the chain appears um, very, very sharp, almost like spaghetti. <laughs> so uh, I guess it does show, though, that it, um, the carburetor might want slightly tweaking in the cut, um, just so it, it leans out and just peaks slightly better while cutting, but still obviously cutting. I'll quickly show it on a restart. And, the idle, although it's beautifully slow, is, um, you know, some, you could obviously very simply adjust the, the tick over screw up. Kill switch. Oh. Joke. Okay, thanks for watching. So there she is, she's a beautiful old saw. Uh, 77 cc's, between 52 and 55 years old, around that age. It's running a 20 inch genuine Oregon solid nose bar. And uh, any questions, yep, yeah, please call me, uh, message me. And if anybody needs to come out and take a look at it, you'd be more than welcome to. Thanks for watching, bye for now.